Hello everyone and welcome to the LVMH Innovation Award Ceremony. We will announce the 2022 winner for the Innovation Award. The big winner, Toshi! When we were announced as the winner, I thought it's a mistake. It's overwhelming, it's absolutely emotional. My name is Sojin Lee, and I am the CEO and founder of Toshi. The vision of Toshi is that we will have changed the face of logistics. Alors Toshi, ça a été euh, le coup de foudre au premier regard. C'est important pour moi d'avoir une une connexion euh, émotionnelle avec la start-up avec, avec qui je vais travailler. On cherchait chez Rimova depuis euh, déjà trois ans un prestataire qui puisse euh, partager nos valeurs de sustainability, prendre soin de ses collaborateurs, faire développer l'expérience client jusqu'à la livraison, c'est un enjeu crucial des maisons d'LVMH aujourd'hui. Toshi is a last mile delivery company where we specialize in scheduled delivery. So it's a real client delivery experience because we offer these services like wait and try and try before you buy, people are much more engaged with the control and the reliability of saying, hey, I am the customer. Le luxe est le choix dans la supply chain. Ouais. On parle beaucoup chez Rimova de luxe fonctionnel. Tout ce qu'on fait, ça doit avoir une utilité pour le client. If we can make logistics more relevant and sexy in giving delight and happiness to consumers, then why is nobody doing this? I'll give it a go. Let's do it. After winning the Innovation Award, Toshi was able to join a one-year program within our ecosystem, integrating our accelerator, La Maison des Startups LVMH, at Station F in Paris and got the chance to discuss with many Maisons, including Remova, Louis Vuitton, Tiffany, or Fendi. Working with LVMH, it helps you, as an entrepreneur and as a startup, believe in yourself. Any startup in this sector will already know that the LVMH Innovation Award is important and it's an opportunity to validate your business, right? And I have this amazing group believing in what we are doing. And I think to create a company, you may have the idea, but you will never succeed in anything unless you have people around you. 